Go. Well, I'm at the discipline meeting. It's nice to uh, be back here tonight. Thanks for all the good wishes and what have you. So it's nice to be back. Well, we're back to stay here. <laughs> so, apologies for absence 2324 slash 93. Apologies for absence. To no apologies for absence. Have we all seen the book at Rachel? Yeah, I'll see. Let's just. I'll pause it. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. All in favour? Yeah. 232494. Disclosures of interest to receive declarations of interest from council on items on the agenda. Anybody? No. Have we received any written requests? No. No. So that's that. 232495 to approve the minutes of the meeting held on Tuesday, 16th of January. As a true and pure echo. That's yeah. circulated. Do look okay? Does that yeah. look okay? I'll propose. I'll Sec second it. Propose a sign, sure. Well, I'm, obviously I'm abstaining. Yeah. 232496, confidential items to be discussed. Anything? Nothing. 232497, two, public participation. No public here, so we'll just straight on. 232498, ongoing issues, any notified planning panels? No. Nope. Or planning appeals, or anything at all? No. 232499, to note the planning decisions from Bradford Council, as Nico has very kindly has always done as a list. It's interesting to see that that hairdresser, that lady wanted to put hairdresser in the front room, refused that. Looks a very one last one, though it's number seven. I, I had a quick look at that this afternoon, and they refused because she was doing it under committed development. You no. see, it's a full planning application. So, so she can resubmit then. Yes, yeah, so yeah. I'm not sure in principle that they're, they're opposed. It's just they should have put the proper protocol, yeah. right? Yeah. And then there's the other one, replacement windows, which a bit, seems a bit strange, mm. but it's retrospective. Yeah, yeah, I'm surprised about that one. I, mean, I don't think we'll go over doing bad. Mm -hmm. And they look like next doors. Do they? Yeah. I don't think we're doing bad overall, are we? So it's, uh, it's a list of buildings, isn't it? Yeah, mm. I think that's the... Again, I had a quick look at that one. They said because the frames on it too deep. Maybe next doors don't have frames. Mm -hmm. Don't they? <laughs> Interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway. 232400, consideration planning application number one, 23 slash 0 double four five eight, and this went to, who did these go to number one? Mark, was it? I think Mark, I sent you quite a few, didn't I? Just yeah. barely a second, <laughs> I did. <laughs> Just and, uh, uh, February, yes. Mark got number one and number two. Just pull it up on Otley and High Ridge, Otley Road, that's the one. Right. 12 Stone Hill, Eldwick. Harry Jotley Road. Harry Jotley, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's one. I'm on the wrong one then. I don't know. And then. That's the one I've got, that's number two. Is this in plans? I know it's it. Oh, so we're big plans. Yeah, Harry Jotley Road. Harry Jotley Road, Eldwick, yes. So what do you want to say, it's sorry? It's all the plans. And a quick look at this, and there's four, you know, five objections. Yeah to it and also who is it is yeah, it gas the gas northern, board northern gas yeah uh, object to object it object to well. it because it's too near that infrastructure because it's enough information yeah. and a previous refusal um due to highways intensification and the lack of passing <coughs> places to be one passing place but I, I was more worried about it overlooking the properties behind. Yeah, it's because the property in front that has been built in its back garden is fine. Mm. You have to see now. So we uh, are refusing it. Out as the properties behind looks. Are we looking to refuse it? I think we should refuse it yeah. on the grounds of well, supporting the com com comments from the gas board. Yeah, supporting comments from gas board and picking up on the previous highways intensification and lack of passing places. Is that enough? There only appears to be one now. Is that enough? Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and possible overlooking of properties behind. Yeah. Are you proposing? I'll propose it. Right? Second that. All in favour? Thank you. Number two, 23 slash 047212. Now we've gone for 12 Stonehill, Eldwick. Another one of Mark's. Well, they do, yeah, grooming parlour. Well, I think they're limited on space. Have a look at the plans. Mm, right. Uh, 
score of which he's in that yeah, yeah, as well. It's, un- it's understandable, really. I mean, running a, a business. business. And I, I think we can take heart from the refusal. That's right, the one at the bottom. There. There. Yeah. It's a yeah. material change in mm-hmm. use. It's yeah. going from residential well, it, it, it to commercial. It is a full planning application. Yeah. Yeah. So that's yeah. where it can. Yeah. 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 They haven't addressed it in the application. Yeah. So what they're doing then, Mark? Can you just enlighten us what they're doing? The proposed outbuilding there, which is circular, yeah. see, they wanted to make that into a dog grooming parlour. And what is it at the moment? Is it anything? It's nothing. There's nothing. It's just nothing. Just nothing. It's nothing there. Yeah. Nothing. Yeah. So they wanted to build. They wanted to build, obviously, and put it out there. Yeah. But I think, I think well, so. given the amount of dog groomers I see flying about in vans, not about a dog here. This. I don't think it's a, an idea for planning for, for accepting. It was, I think, for me, I think if you look up the design and access statement, there's a picture of that sideway, and it's, it's, it's only about that yeah, wide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's about eight inches wide, isn't it? Yeah. 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 It's so not going to be and and it's and they're saying you, you can park outside, but it's 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 on the road junction. Yeah, it's on the road junction. It's only one parking spot on the property. Yeah, uh, it's growing now. That's the one. So, yeah. so you're going to walk you walk. Well, you don't get the minimum. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right next to next door neighbours. No, I think but we've I got mean, to it. commercialisation of a residential. Well, area. Are we? Yeah. Are we? Um, refusing it. Refusing it on the ground. Let me just say we were we're in support of the hairdressers yeah, last, but we voted in support of it. We did. We did. Um, I don't really see much of a difference here. I mean that that is used any that yeah, could, be used, that could be used several times a day by the residents that walkway, couldn't it? So yeah, the hairdressers are all inside the building and going out with their hair done and coming out. So the dog room was a out and about all over the place, aren't they? It seems like this person wants to. Just so Mark is, they want to, they want to run a business from there. That's the top and bottom. Yeah, yeah. Mark is proposing yeah. refusal on the grounds of. Well, I don't think it's suitable for the area that it's going to be commercialisation of a residential yeah. area, and uh, the I would have said the uh, <coughs> parking arrangements uh, near, opposite, near the junction. Opposite yeah. junction. And do we have a second? And, and leaving dogs down there. Yeah, I, I just yeah. think that's too narrow. Yeah. And do we have a seconder for that, please? Are we all in favour? One abstention. Or against? Abstention. Abstention. Number three, 20, 20, can't speak, 24 slash, oh, you can have 24, slash 00053, Russell Wood Parkside. Did this go to Bill? Um, I'm going to be long here. So. Yeah. Number three did, yeah. It's just a tiny little, is it? Porch extension, really, isn't it? It's like creation of a thought. Yeah, so nothing there. <coughs> yeah, there's no objections uh, as of yesterday. Are we proposing it then? It just looks like creating a... It's like a little... It looks like a porch, but I don't think there's a door into it. Yeah. No, it's a bathroom. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. not a bathroom. plan. It's not a bathroom. It's just a little bathroom. Right. Just in. No, we, um, it's, it's something and nothing at the back of the property. Are you approving it? No, approve. Yeah, yeah that's true. All in favour, approve. Thank you. Number four twenty three slash zero four one zero one fifty nine Primrose Bank. Did this go to you, David? I think this might go to me. Who did this go to the word? Number four to Andrew. Mm. Well, because Andrew's not here. Not here. I had a look at it, but can you just get it up, sir? Yeah. yeah. That's the one we had. Yeah, it's had a few reserve goals, matters. And, uh, reserve application reserve. Well, reserve. This is a reserve matters, yeah. yeah. So it's down so it's application. Planning to do it. It's the. I mean, in terms, it's in, 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 in it's terms, awful. In terms of dotting off your reserve matters, that I don't think they've provided anywhere near no. enough no. info. No. Isn't there a consul, a police consultation as well? Yes, with all sorts, yeah, but it's they, a generic they, police. Yeah, they, they seem to put a load of... Oh, is that them. just their normal... Yeah, some might apply, <laughs> I think it says, oh, right. somewhere. I couldn't say which ones. <laughs> From yeah. what they've submitted, yeah. I found, found it really hard to work mm. out what they were planning and doing. Mm. I don't think we were overexcited about it. We rejected place. it in the first yeah. place. Yeah. So so how do I feel about it? Didn't comment. How do I feel about this then? So, so for me, it's got the the proposing too much render. They seem to have different wall, different material for the yeah. windows and doors, and there's, sure. there's nothing on landscaping. So they're not 
just insufficient, insufficient information, information to, to make a, to make a judgment, judgment are you, on the reserve matters. Yes. Yeah. Are you opposing refusal? I'm opposing refusal, yeah. On the grounds of insufficient information. information to address the reserve matters. Thank you. Daily single, second. All in favour? Yeah. Thank you. The family 24 slash 0 0 15A Longwood Avenue. Did this go to Rachel? Yeah, I think it did. It did. <laughs> it did, yeah. The documents are over by the phone. Right. What is it? Yeah. So, well, which document do you want to say? Uh, proposed floor plans, please. It was it was building a garage. It was building a few extra things, but it's a, it's a big parcel it's of a land. Huge parcel of land. I can't see that they're doing a quite a bit, but it's yeah. all sort of like cosmetic. There's a there's a porch. There's mm. They're the, the, the 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 redoing the conservatory. Yeah, it just yeah. seems like your average sort of up, yeah, upscale. What about the nineteen sixties? Where, where yeah. is? Um, it's near Bingham. Oh, one of the roads that get afflicted with the parking. So, what do we feel then? I think it's fine. There's there's enough there's enough land to do. It's not going to be all cramped. So, I'm sorry. All in favour? Yeah. Thank you. 2324 slash 101 Delegation of Planning Decisions to discuss the suggestion of delegation of planning decisions to an officer of the council, deputy clerk, town clerk, following a majority agreement. Have councillors via email for recommendation to full council. This came about with a discussion between Nico and myself. Yeah. Shall I start it well? Yeah. When at one stage we had only three applications and we felt that by the time we've got here, to open the door, put the light on, we'll be putting light off and going home. Mm. So we, we wondered how people felt about about delegating, about what would happen, but if there was only two or three, the applications would go around to everybody on the committee. Everybody on the committee would then email in their thoughts. It would also serve if we didn't have enough time to comment and yeah, we didn't get an extension. Because there are some that um, we've not had time to look at them because there's been no extension. There's one or two we've missed, not my fault, not Nicholas' fault, he's just my much concerned with this. So, some, he just hasn't given us any leeway at all. But if we'd had this, we might have had time to comment. So, comments please. Did you want to say anything, Nicholas? It, it, it was just a thought, if we've got a delegation of power, we can use it. We don't have to use it. But well, it's then written in standard yeah, order as a delegation. Yeah. So I was, was going to say because it probably isn't in standard order at the moment. It's no, it isn't. I, I, I did check. Yeah. Um, but it's just it, it's like a coverall in yeah. case we needed to so use it. I, I think it could be used as an emergency. Mm. Yeah. But to actually I don't think substitute uh, two or three or four agenda actually because there's what five of it or we can do a quick agenda and get the email. Sort of taking away from actually having well, a committee to do it. We need to meet. People might want to come and make comment, and I think we should only use uh, non face to face in a time limited area where we, we haven't time to organise a meeting and there's no deadline extension. Otherwise, we might as well just do it on Zoom. And, which we're not allowed to do. Yeah, yeah. I, th so. I think it's more okay in an emergency. Yeah. I think in an emergency, and if we're going to miss an opportunity to yeah. comment, then it sounds it seems like a sensible thing. Rachel, um, I I, prefer, I think the meetings where where there's a sort of a forum like this, rather than just doing it by email, you can you can discuss matters a yeah. bit more yeah. and perhaps pers persuade other people a bit mm. more. I yeah. don't like the idea of <coughs> just doing it no. by email. I think only mm -hmm. for time sensitive things i think even if there is just three things on the agenda it's right. it's still three things on the agenda <laughs> that deserves our discussion yeah. unless it's won't wait for the yeah. next meeting bill um i think you would deny the public the opportunity to come and well. speak mm. if they wanted to yeah i know we don't get many people from the public but there is the opportunity to come here 
And if we're not doing it, then we'll obviously be mm. open to criticism, won't we? Mm. On that one front, I mean, clearly, I think it doesn't matter how many there is, it's always useful to sit and, and to discuss so it. So it sounds to me that, that I'm, I'm getting the feeling of the meeting that we only want to do this in an absolute time emergency. I would think that would be a sensible thing. And we yeah. don't want to... Oh, um, okay. Time constraint. Yeah. One, that's a time constraint. That's yeah. a matter of view. Yeah. Yeah. I think the time constraint is they want us to make a decision by a certain yeah. time, and we don't physically have enough time to organise a meeting. Mm. Can I it's just a, it to... could be if it's in there, we can use it for an emergency. You know, I've wanted to make a proposal then, please, on this. I'm not sure if the floor is on board. What's, what's the proposal? Oh, what's the proposal? Yeah, proposal. Stand, uh, yeah. To look at standing orders yes. with the view to inserting in exceptional circumstances yes. such as uh, sure, an imminent yeah, deadline yeah. for yeah. us to comment and our <coughs> ability not to give the due mm. notice for a meeting. Yeah, or not be able to meet because of bad weather. You know. I think we just need we need, we need yeah. words that are exceptional yeah. circumstances. Yeah. Which that, is that, yeah. bad weather. Well, yeah. 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 Which you can use to your advantage if you need yes. it to. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, we got all, we got all so, so, so yeah. on that line, uh, are you proposing that, David? I'm quite happy to propose. Do you have a second? And are we all in favour? Mm -hmm. I mean, we've, yes, we've got to review standing orders. No, it's fair enough. It was just a comment we had, and we said, well, let's yeah. take it from yeah. See how people feel. Like and it, it, it will be a full council meeting, um, you know, decision. Council. So it's just a recommendation to full council. Let's in extreme circumstances. Next meeting, Tuesday, 12th of March. Thank you very much. I'm sorry it's been so long.